me it's about honor, it's about pride and it's about changing mindset of um, you know our people back at back in PNG. Um, yeah um, back home, you know, we 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 don't get the sub much support as the men. So yeah for me it's about inspiring, you know, the next batch of girls that are coming through as well and yeah. It's just four things. It's about yeah. Um, it's about honor. It's about pride. It's about um, inspiring the next girl, next batch of girls that are coming through. Yes, I think um, that that one year of delay, I think it's sort of like a blessing in disguise for us. Um, it's you know it gives us more time to um, you know select a group of girls that you know um, would come here, gel well together, and then to compete. So I think that one year um, of delay, I think it's just it's, it's a blessing in disguise for us. Yeah, I think um, um, I think all all the teams are you know equally um, you know at this stage at this stage of um, competition that you, you don't take any team lightly, and I think you know every one of those teams deserves to be here, and you know we, we won't take them lightly, and um, yeah we're just uh, concentrating on the first game which is Canada, and um, yeah I think um, it'll be a good game against all three all three games. Um, we've played against England, and I think they beat us once uh, in 2019 and I think we got them back the second test so yeah it'll be a pretty tough game but you know we're up, up for it and we're here to we're here to compete and improve as individuals and as players. In my team, Essay Banu, uh, she's one tough tough less. Um, yeah, she hits hard, hard as well, so yeah, if, if there's any player I wouldn't want to play against, that would be Esebanu. <laughs> Again, I'd say Esebanu uh, would be a breakthrough star for, in our team in this World Cup. Like I said before, um, the thing that motivates me is um, my family, first and foremost. And I think secondly is about inspiring you know, other girls back home uh, to have someone to look up to and um, to you know, show them that you know, we're not just second to men. You know, we can be much, you know, we can be more than that. And yeah, just to be that person um, to show the girls that, you know, you can do more is what inspires me to, you know, play rugby league. For us, like I said before, PNG is a country where a uh, woman is in a second to men. And for me to be in this position, to be playing in the NRLW, to get a contract to play overseas and to live overseas, is something a few of the girls, you know, few women would have opportunity for women would have in PNG. So for me to have that and to be in that position and to be that role model to the girls is, yeah, it's something phenomenal. I think it is very important because, um, yeah, like you said, like it is, I think, one of the best um, uh, inclusive sport in the in the world. Because, like you said, we have a wheelchair, and then we have the women's and the men's taking part as well. And I think it's very important that you know in, about inclu inclusivity. So yeah, I feel it'll be a good um, World Cup, and yeah, we'll see how it goes.